La Guajira region of Colombia is one of the poorest in South America. But in this remote, arid landscape, the powerful winds that blow along the northern coast have triggered a unique project that is setting an example for the world. This is the story of the Hepiahachi Wind Power Project and how it is benefiting both the local Wayu indigenous community and the planet. The impoverished Wayu may not understand the intricacies of the Kyoto Protocol and its clean development mechanism, but they do know that the wind turbines that turn constantly along their coast are bringing benefits to their people, benefits that would never have come their way. The project, 15 wind turbines totaling 19 and a half megawatts, was built in 2004 by the Colombian utility Empresas Publicas de Medellin. The clean electricity produced by the wind turbines feeds into the Colombia grid, replacing coal or thermal generation. The prototype carbon fund is buying almost 300,000 tons of greenhouse gas emission reductions from the project. And in a unique twist, a percentage goes to the YU for community benefits, with an even larger contribution from the utility itself. This includes a desalination plant that converts seawater into drinking water for the community, resulting in a reduction in waterborne diseases. Another benefit is the construction of 14 new classrooms, as well as the provision of school supplies for the children. There are now employment opportunities that weren't there before. Women have relearned their ancient weaving skills and now sell their intricate pattern bags around the world. You might say that this wind farm is small compared to the power needs of the country, and indeed it is. But to look at Hepirachi is to look at the future. It is the promise of what could be in Latin America and around the world. Winds such as the ones at Hepiahachi are indeed mighty winds of change. <laughs>